Yes. People keep talking. <laughs> and this is your first full album. Yeah. How do you feel? How do you feel right now? It's weird because I put out a lot of mixtapes, so right. those are kind of like albums nowadays. Like right. the distinction is hard, but yeah, technically this is the first full album. It's the first time that it's been in stores. Right. So that's. A cool G. It's big. It's, it's definitely cool. big. Uh, yeah, I, I was. I, we were right past like a Best Buy near Panera, and I was like, I wonder if they have it in there. But we just stopped by. <laughs> Probably not. You know, it's but maybe. In there. I don't it's, know. It's in there. Maybe like one copy is in there. <laughs> yeah, because they all have it. <laughs> all right, so we're all about it. Yeah. New single with Pun. Sheeran. Yes, yes, we're spinning it on the radio. Yeah, I thank you for that. How did that collaboration come about? Um, I've I've known Ed for a few years. And uh, we've been friends and drinking buddies, and we hang out every time. Every <laughs> Don't time he's in that. New York, <laughs> yeah. And it was just like we decided to uh, work on a song one day, and it was awesome. And we love it. They love yeah, it. Do y'all love it? All about it. <laughs> <laughs> so when did you realize you wanted to be a rapper? Like when did you know like that was your calling? Because you went to the University of Pennsylvania. Yeah. You have a degree in finance and marketing, I believe, mm -hmm. right? Research game on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No. I've, so I've, how did you the rap, like rapping aspect, how did that come in, into your life? Like, I, I started writing raps when I was probably like 12 years old, okay, and recording on my like broke ass laptop <laughs> and stuff. Um, but yeah, it's, it's been something that's been a hobby and then a passion of mine for a really long time, okay. and then <coughs> luckily morphed into a career. Hoodie Allen, how did you come up with that name? I don't have a really good story. It's just, <laughs> it's just, it's just sort of a play on Woody Allen originally. So I don't weird. know if they know who that is. <laughs> Y'all know who that is? Yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. <laughs> He's my dad. <laughs> <laughs> so where do you get the inspiration for your songs? They seem very, very personal. Like uh, I try to, I try to pull mostly from uh, real stuff in my in my life, whether it's relationship based or or just not just guy or girl, but any, any sort of relationship. I think it's a lot of what. Uh, this album is about is about like um, how we interact with people, whether it's in real life or in social media, and how everyone has an opinion on everything in the world and stuff like that. Right, it's real life experience. Like yeah, for sure. Exactly. If you could pick one artist, just one, who would you love to collab with? Uh, maybe like just Timberlake. <gasps> okay. Or, okay. Uh, I would just try not to mess it up. Or like I. Uh, <laughs> J. Cole would be really cool. Oh man, I see it. Please, yeah. we need to make that happen. <laughs> we need to make awesome. that happen. Yeah. For sure, for sure. So, how's life on tour? You're on tour right now. It's pretty great. Yeah, we're, we're in Fort Wayne. Yeah. 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 This is the funnest place so far, right? I mean, we flew in here super early, and that was awesome and fun. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. Um, no, no, we've never been here before, so this is really cool. And thank you guys for hanging out. I don't, like, I don't know if you had to do something else today, but thanks for skipping it. <laughs> work? Good, yeah. I hope you don't get fired, though. It's not worth it. Okay, cool. So we've got the hot seat. You're in the hot seat. This feels, yeah. <laughs> you have to answer the question as fast as you can, okay? Okay. Okay. Chicken or steak? Steak. Cake or pie? Cake. Icky or Nicki Minaj? <laughs> Beyonce or Jay? Beyonce. Okay. <laughs> Boxers or briefs? Boxer briefs? <laughs> Big city or small town? Big city. Alright. So it is Monday Crush Monday. A man crush Monday. I'm so sorry. It is man, man crush it's Monday. Monday. Man, crush sure. on Monday. <laughs> man crush Monday, and I'm sure a lot of these ladies, you are their man crush. That's but stupid. ladies. <laughs> Um, Mike Trueblood. Yeah. Get it. Or like Dave Franco, I don't know. Well, all right. All right, but lastly, do you have any advice for those aspiring rappers? Just don't do it. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. Um, well, not just rappers or any musician or anything in life, I would just say, um, work as hard as you can. Don't, like, don't let that be the reason why your your dream or whatever didn't happen. Like at least put everything you have into it and then you can't blame anything but whatever the plan is. I think I think good stuff rises to the top. So if you're good, you'll find your home and you'll be happy and you'll be good. So whatever your passion is, go ahead and push you for it. Absolutely, otherwise you would be doing, I mean, you love what you're doing? I absolutely love it. I'm so happy to 
be yeah. sitting here talking to you. Yeah, it's, 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 it's the best. You wake it up and you're so excited. So that's what I think everyone should do. It's amazing. Unless you don't have talent, then you're screwed. <laughs> Keep it talking. Big thanks. Thank you so much. Thank you, Indiana Tate.